Hello all, my name is Krish Naik and welcome to my YouTube channel. So guys, finally, I'm going to start the seven days end-to-end -end machine learning project implementation with MLOps and CICD pipelines. I had announced this last month that I'm planning to do it and I had asked a question that whether you want recorded videos or live session and many of you had actually demanded for the recorded videos. So yes, finally, uh, from tomorrow, that is Sunday, that is 5th March, uh, at 8 p.m. you'll be getting the recorded videos this entire machine learning project what i have done is that i will try to divide this into five to six part because trust me when we are developing end-to-end -end ml project using ci cd pipeline it is usually and using this modular programming right uh, it usually takes time to implement those solutions right so what we'll do is that i'll try to divide that into part four to part five and we'll try to implement those now uh, whatever things i'm implementing it will be a generic project structure i also make sure that it will be a generic uh, project structure so that later on whenever you change any kind of data set you will be easily be able to implement it just to talk about like what all things we will be focusing on so here uh, in the end-to-end -end projects right we will be developing components like data ingestion data transformation model trainer evaluation and model deployment and this all will be in the form of ci cd pipelines okay so this will be in the form of ci cd pipelines where we will specifically be creating all these things right and uh, later on we will also be doing deployment in various clouds uh, uh, when we say git deployment now in the ci cd pipeline we will start with something called as github actions right so github actions will be using it uh, for the deployment purpose also we'll be using aws right and this github action along with aws we will try to run something called as code runner and all there are many things that is going to come up so uh, when we are mostly discussing this will be the five parts that we'll be discussing and there will be one more additional part like how to set up the project with github right so this is what we are going to do initially right set up the project with github then we'll probably go ahead uh, with logger and exception then we'll create the data ingestion data transformation and all okay uh, just to give you an idea how the project will look like this is how the project is going to look like you can see this uh, i'm still developing this project uh, some videos have already been recorded so tomorrow it will be available to you all uh, and uh, probably in one and a half week time span all the videos will be recorded and part by part and it will be available to you so here you can see in the source i'll be developing components pipeline exception logger utils we'll talk about why all these things are very much important how to probably create an environment how to use dockers right everything will be available so that you can quickly execute this we'll talk about artifacts how to create this pickle file how to deploy this pickle file in aws how to push this pickle file in aws s3 bucket everything we'll be discussing as we go ahead right now here you can see dot github this is for the workflow and this is what I am actually talking about with respect to continuous integration uh, and the continuous deployment uh, where we'll provide our uh, secret key with respect to AWS and automatically the deployment will also happen. So all these things will be happening in this specific uh, series. Uh, all I want from your side is complete dedication because trust me guys, I've seen people who are who are like who have implemented this kind of projects and are able to explain the interview trust me they're able to do some amazing thing they're able to get the jobs also very much quickly not only one or two offers multiple offers right and that is a strategy you should also use to crack any data science interviews you'll also feel confident because after implementing so big solutions right you will be probably getting errors we'll try to fix the error and that is how we are going to proceed right so yes uh, this was it all I want from you is that complete dedication and please do share this video everywhere. LinkedIn, uh, probably you want to share it in any Telegram channel and any WhatsApp group. Please do that because it will definitely be helpful for a larger people, right? So from tomorrow, part by part, all the videos will be coming. Let's do this and let's uh, educate all the people like how probably we can probably develop an end-to-end -end project. So yes, this was it from my side. I will see you all in the next video. Thank you.